Thank you. Be thankful for every cloud you see in the sky today. The season's first wa heat wave is something that is going to be tough for a lot of people that have to work outside in that scorching sun. KSHB 41 News reporter Daniela Leone live for us this morning in KC near Southwest Boulevard. Daniela, road crews used to working in the heat, but this is extreme heat. They have to make extra adaptations whenever they're going to be in this kind of heat, right? Yeah, that's right, Taylor. Good morning. Whether it's hot or cold, these guys are out in full force making the necessary repairs on our roadways. I'm by Southwest Boulevard, where there's a lot of repair work being done all along the stretch. And behind me are a couple of crew members that showed up about 20 minutes ago getting ready to start their day. I actually spoke to a worker within the city of Kansas City, and he told me it's all about listening to your body. Take lots of breaks if you need to. Uh, like I said, um, stay hydrated, uh, stay focused, what you need to be doing during out the day, what we have to do. Now, Orlando, who you just met there, was out yesterday fixing potholes near 24th and Prospect. He has a manager who is constantly checking on him and his co-workers and has routine water breaks during his shift. Now, they start on major roads first and then move to the shade and fix potholes when the sun becomes unbearable and move to their car if the heat becomes too much. The city also has cooling centers for employees, and these guys know if they are feeling overwhelmed, their safety comes first. If it gets too hot, as I said, move into shaded areas and they can take breaks. We have um, regional centers where they can go during their lunch break. They can cool off. They can get air conditioning. They get air conditioning in their car. They're um, asked to take periodic breaks. So we are making sure that our employees are feel not feeling the heat too much. And when it comes to that mix and fixing those potholes on the side, the work is done faster because the mix melts with the heat and the sun onto the pavement a lot quicker. Reporting in Kansas City, Missouri, Danielle Leon, KSHB 41 News. So, Daniela, when we're talking about extreme heat like this and people having to be extra careful, we already know there's worker shortages in a lot of situations. Are there any projects that are seeing delays because of any of these problems right now? I asked the city that, Taylor, and they told me, no, not right now. No major work is being delayed because of the heat, which is very good news. All right, Daniel, you're on live for us this morning near Southwest Boulevard. Daniel, thank you very much.